Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. It is CCC and we are playing some Madden today. This is Madden 19. I'm a um, comment down below um, who I should play against next. I'm curious against the Green Bay Packers. Stadium, and I guess the Buffalo Packers. Yay. And we are playing at Buckingham Stadium. We've got a good matchup on tap between the Green Bay Packers and the Kansas City Chiefs. Oh, twisting away. Oh, he did it again. Oh. And down at the 32 yard line. Great return. It's a Hail Mary. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> I'm not going to be surprised at this point. I'm not trying to grab. Sorry. On first down, Two. Holmes. But he's going to take a shot right uh, away. Oh, and it's time to complete. Boy, they took a shot there on the first play, trying to start it out with a bang, but it's second down. But that certainly looked like something that they discussed all week in practice, getting ready for this one. I'm at the 40 Take the big shot right, right out of the gate. Time. At worst, you open up the defense okay. a little bit, loosen them up. I got my own. Back oh. the Man, to to that's They'll get this wow. one down near the 20-yard line, it's just shy of the 20. Awesome. That's and that one results in 35 yards. You can play, but I'm in my way. You towards the defender, right? You know I'm going to do uh, that. That's a tough situation for him, as I see it. But the truth of the matter is, that ball yeah, was not streaking towards him. Really he's got to find it. Okay. That was bad. Kenny Clark continuing to fight down the field. The big tackle gets him for a loss of 11. Yeah. I don't know what you were seeing on that play, but it felt to me like I wasn't watching the football field. I was watching a boxing ring. Watching, but he was bobbing and weaving and trying to make sure he kept the play alive. Just didn't turn out well for him in the end. Dude. Impressive that he stayed Go in the pocket. Go check out the Agony Dog. I don't know if he's going to be subs. We need yeah. some subs. Please subscribe to us. I want to win, but sometimes we're going to be staring at the third and we're going to make a YouTube video together. Like it, Stay like tuned it, for that. Like it. Get everyone involved in the passing game, and you know you well, those great mismatches. Throw it to your guys Whatever. out in the backfield. And on the first drive, that can also help establish some rhythm, right? I think so. It gets everyone involved. They feel like they're part of it. It really gets them amped up as they go forward. Here's Mahomes to throw, and he knocks the ball. Falls incomplete. Kevin King, the former Washington Husky, there defensively. Certainly looked like they were getting ready to convert there on third down, but what an effort to get his hand on that one, knock it away, and brings up a fourth down decision. Oh, those bats. Mmm, <gasps> mac and cheese. Please and that is not going to get the Mac and cheese on the sure. It's no good. Mac and cheese, mac and cheese, mac and cheese, mac and cheese, mac and cheese. Mac and so cheese. it's an empty possession there, and you have to say it's not mac and cheese. Come up short on a kick like that. Yeah, it's real easy for me to say this, but anything in the 40 to 49 yard range should be pretty automatic for an NFL kicker, especially in I mean, terms of at least me, getting it there. So you're right. That is a surprise no. that this would come in, up In real life, I probably would have not been that close. Back up first and ten. Back to the yeah, five yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Okay. Now the first carry for Ty Montgomery. And yeah, we'll get this one up to about the 39 here. Call it a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. Tough running there. That's a hard earned four yards. Yeah, those have done some kind of runs. They don't throw up the stat sheet, but they do set you up in good position on second down. Second down, Montgomery. And he's across the 40 for the extra yards to the 43. Give him four on the carry, and it'll make this a third and about two. Back to back four yard runs. Now, look, if they just do that all the way down, field ball ends up in the end zone, but that's a little difficult to do. Yeah, I think he's playing against each other. I'm going to check that one now. Runs this up to the 46. Good okay. for the first. <laughs> But just four yards on the pickup, but that's good okay, enough to extend the drive. Well, probably none of these runs individually bad enough. I'm just going to shut up. Maybe now, three plays, three plays okay. all three short runs, but together, a first down. Yeah, it's amazing how the narrative changes when you spring them together. First 
first down. He's the run to Montgomery. And he'll find his way through to about the 48-yard line. Two yards on the pickup there. It'll be second and eight. Looks like they're establishing a pretty good pattern here because they've been very heavy in the running game for the last four plays. Yeah, you took the words right out of my mouth. So far, four plays in this drive, all four on the ground. They're going to play action for Montgomery, and that okay. Oh, let's go! And he's taken down. Justin Houston. Let's go! Let's see Dumpson for a loss of eight. Master. Yeah, we talked about players blitzing all the time. And laugh and sometimes call it just straight ahead pursuit. What a running start right back to the backfield for him. Yeah, you really didn't give anybody a chance to get up there and stop him. No, I mean, that's really, really difficult. You're asking a whole lot anyway. But he gets that time to start and comes through clean. Oftentimes, the advantage definitely goes to the defensive player. And they're able to convert on third with a solid gain of 23. That's an excellent read right there. Saw cover one. That means it's just a single high safety. So you know if you throw the ball to the outside part of the field, help is going to be a little bit late getting there. And he puts one out there for a big time completion. They'll run it now. And this play will be blown up. But Rouge is back at the 38. That's going to go as a loss of two, and it'll be second down. Well, to me, that's taking a big gamble defensively because that alignment, you see, that's probably something you see down near the goal line. Because now, if they decide to go play action, Something should be open there, and I think open big. So maybe that's something that gets filed away for later. I think without a doubt, you write it down, and if you see that look at a later date, go ahead and take your shot. Yes, look at the oh, the quarter, all right. With Charles Davis, on Brandon Gordon, second quarter about to get underway with the Packers in possession of the football, but they face a second and long to start things out. all the time to have a powerful arm isn't the number one thing they look for in a quarterback. But when you're trying to throw inside routes and you need to put some heat on it, it helps have the big gun. In this case, just a little bit too much. Throwing his Rodgers on third down. He's got his targets caught. Oh, I guess I'm just going to do it for the point after. Maybe get into the end zone, but I am losing. It's definitely a chance. That's... Crosby with the extra point, and it's now a second No, it's not. Game. It's not a chance. A good drive that time as they go nine plays in all. And it ends with a Packers touchdown. Crosby on now to kick it away. Hello, Crosby. Now the Chiefs offense, they get ready to head on the field. The last time that they were on the field, a little demoralizing. Missed field goal. You don't always feel like you want to get in the end zone, but then oh, well, at least we're going to get three. Didn't go through the goalpost. Yeah. So. It does yeah. test yeah. the mental processes of the team, though, doesn't it? Because when you miss a field goal, it's amazing how fast it's going to turn on the guy kick. This is caught inside the 15. And he takes this in the end zone for a Chiefs touchdown. Tyreek Hill, 75 yards. And the Chiefs are an extra point away from tying up this football game. Guys, guys, I'm going to take a risk. I'm going to go for two. If I get this, you have to subscribe.
Yeah. Unless you're already subscribed. Good for you if you subscribe so you can and have the notifications on. If you don't have the notifications on, you won't get my videos. If you don't get my videos. Oh no. You don't have the mesh. Everything from behind the receiver. I think they've got to start getting people in front as well to try and knock the ball Sorry, away. Sorry, I'm going to see it. Andy Reid, that number one stupid. to shy away from taking chances. He'll go for two. And that was scary. Out here is the play clock was down to two, and they'll have two remaining. Okay. Now Mahomes to the line as the Chiefs are going to go for the two-point try. I don't know why I'm playing with the Buccaneers field. <laughs> oh, I forgot to do the what? Oh, you. Oh, you. Okay. Yes. You, you got to subscribe. Well, at least like the video. They'll take an 8-7 lead. Subscribe. Well, they got down 7-zip. They said, we'll go for two, one-up you, and they take the lead. How about that for a little risk-reward? Yeah. Right? Mm. If you don't get it, you're only down a point. Let's go ahead and make a statement in this ball game, and that's exactly what the they Chiefs did. won the Super Bowl this year. Good for them. If you're a Chiefs fan, like and subscribe. And comment. I'll reply to you. And I will reply to you. Oh crap, my phone. Sorry. Oh crap, bad kick. I am so sorry, my phone fell down. And yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. I think I got a better view of the. Oops, that's and that drives coaches insane, doesn't it? When they see that happen, it just it just doesn't feel right, does it? Plus, you're giving up the edge. Do you guys believe? Do you guys believe in ghosts? So good field position for the Packers as they come do up you first believe in ten. Ghosts? Comment down below if you believe in ghosts. Do it right now, because I've said to comment down below for a lot of things. So whatever I said, did that guy just die? Did that guy just die? But Peterson, he can't just be he tripped. Let me go see that replay. I want to see this replay. I want to see that replay. Okay, this is the replay. There was a play action, and he just falls right there. Back. He just fell. I don't know what happened, but he fell. That's, that's all I'm going to say. Second five after the five yard completion on first down. <laughs> Sorry about that little delay. I don't have that much storage left, so I shouldn't have did that. It's only going to take about 18 minutes out of my 33 minutes. Yeah. I think I'm fine. Well, he hasn't made much of an impact in the running game thus far, and after that last run, not much is going to change in that area. He hasn't been able to get anything going, and really the offensive line not helping him much. From the gun on third down. And he's done. And he's taken down a cheap sack. Reggie Raglan able to track him down for a loss of 13. Okay, if I get this punt return for a touchdown, you have to see that. He there so quickly, Charles. Well, what could the offense have done to adjust to the cut for that? But what you hope is that you figure out. You still should subscribe. Maybe there's going to be some pressure coming. You really out. still should. You change the blocking schemes. Maybe go to max protection. The biggest one is maybe you bring your running back in to try and keep you clean. But in that case, that didn't happen. Zero accountability and a sack resulted. Mahomes will lead the Chiefs up first and ten at their own 20 yard line. Oh crap, it's my ball. I get it. That was a bad play. No, it was not. He gone, he's gone. Boy, right into the goal. Touchdown. sessions and I'd hear nine for the receivers that meant fly route go 
Look out. That was the nine, and he just kept going all the way into the end zone for the touchdown. An extra point splits the other lights, and the lead is up to eight. Those are the ones the offensive coordinators dream about. One play drives from that distance. What an effort. It results in the touchdown. Butker now to kick this one away. Who's that, Dad? Sorry. Trevor Davis now to return. Okay. And a nice... I'm going to be right back. Hello. My name is Bob. Okay, let's Turn get back. Sets him up pretty good here at the 30-yard line. The Packer offense now ready to get My back onto the Bob. field and hoping to do better than they did in their last possession when they punted the football. Appeal to the she vanity did. of your offensive line. Tell them that they control your fate. Leverage yeah, guys. Win the line of scrimmage. If you do that, you start to win the first down. You win second down. And guess what? You start accumulating. Bad first angle. Down. Sorry. And that's what they need in order to not cut the ball again. They go play action here. First down. And the Chiefs are going to get him. Chris Jones. Coming hard that time. He's able to run him down for a loss of 12. I'm starting to feel for our quarterback back there. I mean, you know me. Normally, they have a lot of empathy for the QB, right? In this case, he's been on constant duress this entire game. And now he's surviving back there. Okay, boy, okay. There's still a long way to go in this football game. And it's a pickup of eight yards to move them into a third and 13 yes, here. Cool. And that looked like some pretty easy yardage there right off the gun. And he's a guy that has some height to him. So when you don't have to drop a shoulder or create or get through contact or trash, it's a lot easier to stay upright, see the field, and make a run as we just saw there. And third and long, it's Rodgers. Oh, some strong runners. Oh, and Mac and Cheese tackling. That goes as a game of 37. I know they have good coverage downfield, but you have to wonder if I'm third and long like that. How does that happen that they can get that far downfield and complete a pass? You gotta guard the sticks, understand where you are, so it's almost like someone fell asleep at the switch. And now that the play's been completed, they're gonna dust themselves off on defense, pick it up, and figure out how to not let that happen again. It's Adams. And he gets us with inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. That one goes for 24 Two yards. In the morning, guys. Two minutes to play here in the first half. We'll come. Commercial break. Okay, that was your commercial break. Get back to the show. Back to Tampa after this timeout. Oh, crud. Sorry. To remind you that coming up at halftime, we'll pay a visit to Jonathan Coachman. He's in Orlando, and we'll have our EA Sports halftime report. Rogers going to throw. Oh, come on, get it. Oh. Thank God. And he's able to get it down to the two-yard line. Give him nine there on the first down completion. We didn't need to ask around the league, but we got to confirm this guy's a good player. They've got to find a way to get him more involved, call a few more plays that target him. Absolutely, because here we are toward the end of the first half, and that's the first target, not just the first catch, first target. Rodgers again now. Get him, get him. Call him up big out of the scrappy defense. Get it, he went to the the amount of sacks that they've absorbed in this game is absolutely extraordinary. Let's just face it. This offensive line, flat out, cannot handle this pass rush. It's been demonstrated time and time again. Rodgers now, after the sack, he'll lead the pack up on third and long. Looking for the gun. 
Now he goes backwards here, losing yards. He caught it. Back to the 16. He lost two, and it brings up four. But I know it goes against the instincts of the person catching the ball because all you're ever taught is catch the football, don't drop it. But drop it there. Yeah, in that situation, <laughs> dropping it would have been better. End up losing yardage, even though he completed the pass. Good as a sack. Yeah, how about that? Although they won't get the same credit for it. And it Just a field goal. So the three points here, they're still down, but they put somewhat of a dent into that lead going into the break. Anything helps when you're trying to trip away at a lead, but they do know. They're going to need a little bit better for the second half. And not willing to risk anything here late in the half. We'll just take a knee and they'll bring okay. the football out to the 25. Now, now the Chiefs offensive unit ready to do battle again. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. Probably a good idea. They'll begin the drive with Hunt. Yeah, it was too bad. Oh, no gain on the play, and it'll be second down. And they had to run for no gain. Now they'll try again from the 25 on second and 10. Mahomes going to hand it off to Hunt. He'll be tackled shy of the 35. Shifty footwork gets him a little extra on the play. And with just four seconds left in this first half, That's a timeout call. Last play to the Am I just in the lab a little? Wait, 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 Teams appear ready for the fight ahead, and we resume action here in quarter number three. And they will not get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchback. The Packers offense now heading back out onto the field. They're close, close game, but they're going to need to do a little bit better probably here in half two, no? I would agree with that totally. I would guess it in the locker room. They talked about cleaning up some of the errors, but overall, I think they wanted to be positive with them. Guys, we're right there. Just not playing as well as we need to. Let's pick it up, and we still have a chance to win this game. Yeah, they do. We'll see if they can pick it up. Third quarter started to run from Montgomery, and he'll fight forward to about the 27-yard line. Give him a couple on the carry there, second and eight. I have to think a major focus of the halftime makes had to be figured out how to create space for the running game. The storage is running low. Out to be a half seems accurate. That line has struggled to sustain blocks. Yeah, I would agree with that totally. They've got to focus on staying on their double teams at the first level. Make sure that block's secure before they slide off and try and chip someone at the second level. Four yards on the pickup there is it'll leave them with a third and about four more for a first. I can't help it. Every time I see Eric Berry make a play, as we just saw him make a tackle there, I just want to stand up and applaud. Because he went to Tennessee like you? Well, that, that doesn't hurt one bit, but how about the comeback? I mean, he came back from, from beating cancer and getting back to pro bowl level, one of the best players in the game. Now a third down throw, but it misses the target incomplete. Well, we're into the second half now. This is an offense that continues to struggle to sustain a drive. Looks like they're just totally out of sync, whether they're running the ball, passing the ball, like we uh, said. Okay, that definitely didn't work. A good return there, call it 13 yards. And it's Chiefs football, first and 10. So here's the Chiefs offense ready for their first reps in half number two. They have the lead here. Well, we talk a lot about pregame speeches. What are halftime speeches like? For the most part, not nearly as emotional. They're a lot more clinical. Every now and then, they'll get off the field. Oh, how does he drop that? Case, let's go into the virtual locker room, because here's what I think happened. They got in there, and they said, listen, let's take control right away. Yeah, defense, got yeah. we, got the de we got the we got the lead. Defense, don't give up any points. Turn the ball back over to the offense, and let them go down and score and give us more of a cushion in the game. Check so far. Defense shut them down. Let's see if the offense gets done. And he'll get it on near the 35, right at the 34 here. It'll be a two-yard game, and they're going to have a third down.
And on third down, a nickel formation here defensively. Here's Mahomes. Tackle pressure and down he goes. Muhammad Wilkerson in there to drop it for a four yard loss and it'll be fourth down. Great job defensively. I think he was trying to go through his progressions, find someone to get rid of the football before he knew it, he was on his back. So that just brings us right back to what you said in the beginning. A great job defensively. Nowhere to go with the football. That led to the sack. It'll be 37 yards there on the play. And it'll be Packer football here. First down and 10. Rodgers will bring the pack up with a first and 10 at about the 32. From the gun, it's Rodgers. Got a man, that's Allison. And he'll get it up to the 33-yard line. Just a yard on the catch there. It'll be second and nine. Well, if you do read man coverage, Brandon, the drag route's a pretty good one to run against it because you're running away from people on it. They only got a yard out of that last completion, and that makes this second and nine. And this is the 10th carry for Ty Montgomery, and he'll get this up to about the 40. Give him six yards on the carry. It's going to be third and three now. It's interesting going into this game, there was so much talk from both sides about who would control the line of scrimmage. I think we've seen who has it in this one so far. Well, they bottled him up. He's barely averaging over three yards a carry right now. And it is incomplete. Not too many things get to a quarterback of this magnitude. But I think it's safe to say that pressure can get to any quarterback. Now he's obviously a great franchise quarterback, but felt the pressure, threw it incomplete. Oh, he's going to go ahead and feel it from the three-yard line. He juked it. Nearly a huge return, as it is. Still a very good one. 24 yards. And that will come the offense as they take over. Shifts past him. Room is open. An outstanding pickup there for the Chiefs. 47 yards. Yes. Lead here in the second half. Obviously, you love big runs like that at any time. Here, you really like them. You're going to have to watch the part two because my storage is almost out. So I am going to make a part two of this. I'm not going to end the video yet. I might have a chance, but there might have to be a part just a part two, okay? Because I am almost out of storage, and this is not looking so good. About the storage. Thing. But the clock is ticking on Madden. The game needs to be better, but the reality is, they've been given little time to actually find a place to run the football. It's almost like the defense is there on the handbox. I can see how. This is him. That was a bit, that was a horrible idea. That was stupid. Why did I do that? I don't know. a loss of 18, and it's going to be third down and forever. It's hard to stay mad at a player who fights for yardage, even if it's not successful. But on this play, I'm just looking at what the defense did. We always talk about gang tackling and getting more people to the football. How about the job they did there, the discipline they had? No matter how hard he fought, more and more people showed up. And help create that big loss of yardage there. Gonna be a close one, guys. About the storage. Okay, six more minutes. So they'll get a little extra time to come up with his third down play as we play back now in Tampa. It's the Chiefs with the lead and the football here as we get set for quarter number four. Need something from deep in the bag of tricks here after first and second down went backwards. It's third and very long. Hike like it. Now, everything here, we're going to get a timeout by the offense. 
I didn't mean to call that. Dang it. Dang it. Oh, yeah. I think I'm on an eighth camera. I'm going to take this clock down because I am in the lead. I'm just going to tick, 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 clock, clock, clock. Buddy. Not saying I have made a 60 yard field goal before. I don't know if you can know, but this is going to be a 60 yard field goal. If I make this, that would be a miracle. I'm going to try it. Uh, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. So on fourth down, out trots the kicker in a big spot oh, here. Shit, 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 they shit. spot it on the midfield strike. No. So it is a 60-yard attempt here. No, 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 no. Delayed game, offense. Dude. And that'll be accepted, of course, and that moves him back five. Still 65 down. yards? There's a chance. So on fourth down, out trots the kicker in a big spot here. 64 was Matt Prater's record. This would top that by a yard. That's running out of steam and a run there. He left it just short. No good. And this score will stay right where it is. So the folks on hand here going a little restless with their kicking game. That's not two misses so far. And in a tight game, fourth quarter, the fans are the only ones getting restless, Brandon. There were a few looks of disbelief on that sideline as well. Throwing over the middle, and it's incomplete. Geronimo Allison, the target there. And that'll bring up second down. And guys, yeah, just watch the part two, please. If my part two doesn't show up. Over the middle to you, and not only the deep I'm sorry. Verbal trash there, well, if you just be able to put it in the link in the description, yeah, I'll definitely do that so you can see the part two. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here and make the part two. And guys, have a good rest of your day. God bless. Goodbye.